Hey guys, this is going to be my very first time to be reacting to anything Bill Burr or anything like um, stand-up comedy, I believe. Oh no, this is my second time because I believe we did one. I just forgot the name of the lady that was like a Japanese lady was like, yeah, we did one stand-up comedy reaction. Guys, do forgive me if I forgot her name. It's nothing personal, okay? It's just that I have reacted to a lot of things and the names, I am just so bad with them, okay? So yes, this time around, you've requested for this one. Bill Burr, no reason to hit a woman. How women argue. From you people, from you people are all the same, okay? So guys, I have no idea what I'm getting myself into, but I know this is a stand-up comedy, so nothing is to be taken seriously, okay? So, but... But, but, that being said though, I still really do believe in the fact that there is no reason for hitting anybody in, in, in any way, form, or matter or situation, you know? Any sort of violence is ever accepted, okay? Um, that's just my take, but hey, let's not get too serious. Let's go ahead and listen to what Bill Burr has to say. So guys, are you ready for this? Without any delay, let's check this one out. Uno, dos, tres, let's play this, come on. No, we have these huge battles. Okay. You know what the maddest she ever got at me was? One time she was watching this show, it was like a poor excuse for The View, and they started talking about domestic violence. Right? For the nine millionth time this year, <laughs> they're talking about domestic violence. Just in case, you know, you didn't get the memo. You know? Okay. Evidently, you know, just some people didn't get it. It's not okay to slam your wife's head into the nope. cupboard drawers no. because she didn't dry the can opener off properly. You know? <laughs> no matter the reason, you it's know. It's gonna fucking rust, right? How do you not know not to do that shit? Do they really have to keep talking about it? Uh, who, who, it's like wife beaters watching for, oh, fuck, ah, now I get it, up a daisy, sweetheart, here we go, there you go, oh. <laughs> so at the end of the hour, they come to the logical conclusion, they're like, there is no reason to hit a woman, there is no reason to hit no. a woman. And I was just like, really? I could give you like 17 right at the top of my head. <laughs> you could wake me from a drunken stupor, I could still give you like nine. <laughs> Dude, there's plenty of reasons to hit a woman. Okay, let you just me don't hear. do let it. Me, let me hear it. Sit there but and suggest on. that there's no reason. <laughs> Dude, the level of ego behind that <laughs> statement. What are you levitating above the rest uh, of us? Oh my god. You're never annoying. <laughs> Women, how many times have you thought about slapping your your fucking guy in the head this week? A lot of times. <laughs> There you go. <laughs> Every day. You didn't do it, right? Oh, dude, it drives me nuts. There's no reason. There's no reason. Really? No reason? How about this? You marry a girl, you fall in love, you buy her a house. You go to work every day, paying off the house. You come home one day, she's banging the next door neighbor, oh. hands you divorce papers. You got to move out, sleep on a futon, oh, and that's still so pay for that house that she's going to stay in. Oh, um, no yeah. That, that, that's so unacceptable, though. <laughs> yeah. I'm not saying you should do it, but there's plenty of fucking reasons. <laughs> In that yeah. arc of the story. Okay, but that's like so extreme, man. But you know, my, my thinking right, was, was like, like, yes, okay. You want an actual story? Mm-hmm. I'll give you one. I'll give you one. All right, I fucked up my <laughs> foot playing drums, trying to get my bass drum foot as okay, fast okay, okay. as uh, John Bonham's, because I figure that's a good thing to focus oh, yeah. on. 43 of years of age, never married, <laughs> no kids. I figure this, this is going to lead me to the light, right? <laughs> this, this, this is what I need to do. Yeah, of course, do you, dude. <laughs> So I don't know what I did. I, I felt like after I played for like an hour and afterwards, I felt like literally like there was some midget stabbing me in the bottom of my foot, right? Like oh, yeah. oh, yeah. I can, I can honestly foot. feel his pain. So I did the typical guy thing. I'm like, I'm not going to the hospital. I'll sleep it yeah. off. Be fine, right? I'm tough. Next morning I wake up, my foot's even worse. And I got to walk my crazy dog. So I'm like, I can't do it. My foot's killing me. So I wake up, my girl go, sweetheart, sweetheart, can you do me a favor? Can you do me a favor? Can, can you walk the dog for no. me? Can you uh, just take the shift? You know, I'll do your afternoon shift. Can you just do me this song? Can you do this for me? And she's just like, oh. You know, I had a late, late night last night. I'm tired. I have a big day. And I just go, fuck it. She goes, what do you mean, fuck it? It's like, why can't you just say no? Why do you always got to, like, waterboard me with, like, a 20-minute Oh, my God, oh, my God, oh, my God, that's so funny. <laughs> Because, you know, I, we just don't want to say no, like, up front. Because sometimes, you know, we don't want you to get the wrong idea that we really don't want to. Even though we really don't want to. 
<laughs> I don't know. Yes, basically, you know, women are from Mars. Uh, you know, w men are from Mars. Women are from Venus. Actually, so we kind of like think so differently. We are kind of like in the defense mode, right? Yeah, I, I just realized it, man. But, you know, we just don't want to say no up front and then with no reasoning behind it. Because like all of you, man, just like say no. And then we're like, what? what what's the reason behind because we need explanation <laughs> that's why oh my god this is like yes yes i just i had just like a a moment of like a realization right here because of this particular you know i have question. a big day and i just go fuck it <laughs> she goes what do you mean fuck it it's like why can't you just say no why do you always gotta like waterboard me with like a 20 minute explanation that eventually winds its way around to go fuck yourself? Just say no. <laughs> so I'm just limping out of the room. Whatever, go back to bed. You got a big day, right? <laughs> we don't now know I'm you're like limping. limping. You didn't street. say no like, nothing. Oh my gosh. Dogs walking next to me. <laughs> and I got, I'm so I got a little childish. I did. I got a little childish, you know? I was just thinking about my relationship. I'm like, this, this is the relationship I'm in? You're just gonna do whatever the hell you wanna do, right? And fuck me? Fine, I'm gonna do whatever the hell I wanna do. I feel like listening to my iPod on full blast, walking around the house. That's mm -hmm. what I'm gonna do. Okay, do, do, do you. So that's what I did. Turned it all the way up, and I just, I, my whole plan was just to walk by her like I didn't even know her. That was it. She came down the hall, I just ghosted her. Just <laughs> past her. No, do not ghost any just woman. Just trying to piss her off. And I gotta tell you something, work like a charm. <laughs> Work like a charm. Yes, of course. Yeah, hung my coat up, turned around. By the time I oh turned my around, gosh. she's already. Oh my gosh, there's nothing more like annoying than a man like ignoring your presence, like as if you don't exist. Come on, but, but then, oh my god, I'm like, I have a lot of like realization just like looking at this, and this is like what four minutes still, ongoing to twelve. But, oh my gosh, this is so true. This is real talk, man, and. As much as I don't want to admit it, I am guilty of all these things. I mean, thus far, okay. But wow, he is like on point. He knows how to like, you know, get to the nerves of every girl. <laughs> oh my gosh, really. He, he does know what he's saying, okay. Just trying to piss her off. And I got to tell you something. It worked. worked. Like a charm. <laughs> worked like a charm. Sure, sure yeah, I did. Hung my coat up, turned around. By the time I turned around, she was already yelling at me. But the music was so loud, not only could I not hear her, it actually looked like she was singing the song. <laughs> it was just, it's, a, oh, it's one of the highlights of the relationship. So I knew what she was saying. I was like, whatever, I don't want to talk about it. Leave me alone. I'm going on to the computer, right? So I oh looked over gosh, and I sit I could down, just picture this to me. She's like, no, we're going to talk about this right now. Comes out <laughs> and slaps the headphones off my head. No, I got a big, I got big ears. It fucking hurt. <laughs> so I'm like, honey, leave me alone. I don't want to talk gosh. about it. Put the headphones back on. She comes right back up again. Poo, slaps them off a little Oh harder. no, I don't this do that. This time they spin halfway around my head. No, 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 no. Caveman no. DNA starts coming up. <laughs> talking through my teeth. Honey, leave me alone. Don't want to talk about it, right? Put them on third time. She comes up. Poo, slaps them right across the room. And I snap. I'm like, fine. You want to have the fight? Let's fucking have the fight. She's like, we will discuss this later when you calm down. <laughs> Right there. I just wanted to roll her up on her yoga mat and stuff her behind the couch. <laughs> just leave her there until she got thirsty. Come on, let me out of here. I, I have a spin class. You've made your point. This is this is ridiculous. Uh, but sometimes we don't we don't want no, no that's conflicts. That's just because. Really is, that's the thing. I, I hate that saying there's no reason. Obviously I'm not saying to hit a woman. You know? No. But saying there's no reason, I think that's crazy. <laughs> there's a reason, but still, you have to control yourself, okay? When you say there's no reason, that kills any sort of examination as to how two people ended up at that, at that place. If you say there's no reason, whoo, you cut out the building. There is a lot of reasons, okay? But how are you going to solve just it, can't do it if you don't figure it out? You know why you just can't do it? Because you're, you're like a hundred times stronger than us women. And, you know, um, although I don't condone women hitting men or anybody there is no reason really there is no 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 right reason for anybody to be hitting anybody okay especially men guys your strength is like it's like just like a t the tip of my fingernails i don't even have like nails enough okay so yes guys uh i just can't because your your 
spirit like that is like like that for us that's how that's how we much differ in strength so that's why you know when women hit guys i'm not saying it's okay okay it's just that it doesn't hurt as much as you hurting us hitting us or anything like that but oh my gosh guys i am no position to be saying these things because i was never in a situation where i was like hit by a man thankfully so but still you know i just can't imagine it uh, a person being in that situation whether you're a boy or a girl if you're gonna be like be constantly be being berated being like abused and stuff like that that is a no 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 that's a big no for for me and for everyone i think yeah but yeah he does have a point though there's a lot of reason <laughs> for you guys to be hitting women but only in your head okay only in your head <laughs> You can't. You're you say just there's too no reason. Strong. You cut out the build-up. You just left with the act. How are you going to solve it if you don't figure it out? Deep breath. Look how awkward <laughs> it is in here right now. <laughs> I said you shouldn't hit a woman. I'm just saying. How come you can't ask questions? You can only ask questions about what the guy did. You can never ask about the woman. Why is that? No, I think you can. Why is that? What is I don't that? know. What is what does answer him right mean? What does that mean? Are you the idiot who got up halfway through the special? <laughs> during the bit and you're like walking around like I'm not fucking taping a special here? What's wrong with you? Oh my What's wrong with gosh. You? Fucking had to ignore all of that and now you're gonna like yell out and not only that, yell something that makes no fucking sense whatsoever. <laughs> oh my God, Bird. Answer him, answer him. Every fucking special I do, there's always one. <laughs> Always right down the fucking middle. Oh, please don't roast her, man. Come Talking on. about hitting women, sweetheart. And I think you just added another reason. Oh, my God. Jesus fucking Christ. Oh, you know, please. I'm not even in a relationship with her, and she's fucking nagging me. Oh, please, no. <laughs> fucking unbelievable. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Look. I understand hitting a woman is a bad thing, okay? What, yes. How come you can't fucking ask questions? I just don't understand. You if I can. get hit by a rattlesnake, wouldn't you guys have some questions? Right. No, How you can't. I actually do encourage did you, not you see to ask it? questions. Were you fucking with it? How did this snake get so mad? It almost killed you. Firemen put out a fire. They don't just drive away afterwards. They sift through the debris. How did it start? Here's an oily rag, right? Look, I realize I'm coming off pretty ignorant right about now. I realize that. Let me extend an olive branch then, okay? I realize that there's some animal guys out there, okay? Mm -hmm. Horrible guys, you know, have a rough also day women. at the factory, also come women. home, turn I mean, a casserole, you know. and just start swinging, all right? I'm not trying to say that those people don't exist. I realize they exist. They should be buried underneath the prison, mm -hmm. okay? So as if I can admit as that, they should. ladies, can you at least admit that every ass kicking doesn't just fall out of the fucking sky? Uh, really? Uh, Even hockey has two minutes for instigating, right? They understand that some back and forth happened before I, that shit. Yeah, you know? I know. I understand that. I'm not disputing that as well. But <laughs> oh my god, he's you know, real talk. Is every case is handled like that Rihanna one, where they just say, the guy's a piece of shit, fuck this guy, blah, 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 send him to jail, and then they never ask anything about that. You know, I'm not saying he should have done it, but I'm just saying. I'm just saying, dude, in your heart of hearts, what do you think was going down before that happened? You but think she was still. just sitting there going, oh my God, Baston Robbins, you want to get some ice cream? He fucking, ah! Oh, but uh, I don't know. I don't know what to say about that. Why am I so defensive, though? Well, Come on, I should have just listened. And then that's the relationship fight, and some crazy shit was being said. Maybe she was screaming in his ear some crazy female but shit. But still, like, oh, you should not be friends. hurting. I don't give a fuck. But still, you should not Maybe be hurting. Maybe that's why I sell more albums than you, motherfucker. <laughs> like, to be fair, she could have just been sitting there going, "I need a tissue. Do you keep those in the glove box?" Oh my god, I'll bring my own. I'll bring my own. Oh my gosh, this is real oh, fuck soccer. that, because you know what it is? They never address how women argue, which I think is the core I, I of do. a lot of that uh, shit. Yes, I, I acknowledge you know, that fact. I and I'm guilty, like, I'm never guilty knew how of women that. Argued. But after 20 years of losing every significant <laughs> battle in a relationship, I finally figured out how they argued. 
And I'm gonna tell you something, I'm starting to turn this franchise around. <laughs> I have begun a winning tradition. Mm -hmm. Let me see, let me hear about that. This is how they argue, as far as I can tell. Oh my God. Right? If they're right, they argue the point. And they stay on point and make sure you stay on point until you're down on your knees, apologizing, begging for forgiveness. No, not All right? really. But we no problem like, with that. We just totally want to make the point across. The okay. If they're wrong, they go rogue. They go off-road. <laughs> they start thinking of shit you're sensitive about. Maybe you don't get along with your dad. And in their head, they just start concocting this evil statement. <laughs> Totally designed this oh desperate my God. Hail Mary attempt how, how, are to you make a girl? you so are you a fucking woman? mad you just call him a cunt. <laughs> That's what it is. And cunt trumps all the bullshit they did to start the argument. Now it's not about that one. That's no reason to call me a cunt. And then that's it. You're in this room now, right? That is my so... girl knows my big thing is my big fear in life is to be that dude who grows old, you know, grows old alone, has like that basement apartment. Just screaming up at the younger couple, turn it down! <laughs> that isn't music! So I noticed that anytime she was losing a fight, I don't know what she'd just be like, well, that's why you're just gonna grow old and be alone. Then I'd, I'd lose my shit. The next thing you know, I'm in the kitchen washing dishes for the ninth fucking time in a row. This is what the argument was about. I was so right. What happened? So if you learn anything from my ignorance tonight. Okay, I'll see. What is it? This. The Next moral time, of all. You're in a battle with your beautiful woman, your, your wife, girlfriend, whatever. And they start out of nowhere. Okay, you're winning and they just start saying that crazy shit out of nowhere. <laughs> just know in that moment you've won the fight. Okay? All right, don't get mad. Bob and Weave slip all of that shit. Maybe because yeah, you got a little dick. Just let that... Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, come on. Yeah, that's good. That's argument. a good advice, though. Okay? It's over. The argument is over. You've won. Just take a knee and run out the clock. All right? That is so yes. true. Ropes, Why do you always get butt hurt as well? <laughs> and then in the end, you throw this psychology right back at him. Well, maybe we should discuss it later when you calm down. And they won't hook up with you for a couple of days. Who cares? Who cares? You rub one out. <laughs> rub one out like a man. It's a champagne of victory. Man, oh man. What he's saying there was like 110% true in my case okay but then of course women just don't want to lose <laughs> and we're gonna hit you where you're most sensitive at because it's not intentional honest to goodness it's not intentional it's just that you know it's a human instinct man i don't know